I go by Ricky Roosevelt. They call Meet me Jared Morris, Morris. the KU senior who doubles as Ricky Roosevelt, I'm the comic book crazed MC. Who was the Wolverines or Spark? You know, I end up just finding a comic book at a uh, at the public store with my mom. Actually, I was just kind of amazed by it, and she let me buy it, and then I just kept reading it over and over. So from that point on, I kind of just went on with comic books, and it's definitely um, something I have a really big passion for today. Like I started a comic book club here, so it's kind of just a big part of my life. Currently a resident of Minnesota. He used to live in Atlanta, Georgia, the home of the subgenre of rap trap music. But Jared would like to keep it old school. Rest in peace to Five Dog. I really love Tribe Called Quest. That was one of the, the first hip hop groups I really got invested in. Like, I heard Electric Relaxation on the Wayne's Brothers intro when I was like six. I was like, man, what is this? Growing up in the suburbs, Jared felt his story wasn't interesting enough to be told as a rapper. But when he embraced his own life, he found his voice. So, what was important for me was really finding my own voice and like figuring out how I rap. You know, I had to rap about. Things that I do, like I said, I like comic books, stuff like that. People call that nerdy in high school, but I don't really care. Like, now it's something I've adopted and made into some, I guess you could say, cool, you know? I wrote this script with intent to be melodic. Yes, I got the logic. Nope, never robotic or bionic. Look at me, laugh at me, but I'm the comic collector. Plastic sleeves covering all my comics. I'm uncommon. Freshman year, I had to rhyme, and I promised my mama not to release and vomit. The knowledge I received and got in college expanded my conscience to fly like a rocket. Now on the weekend, we kick it on Haley's comic. Reporting from Lawrence, Kansas, Jordan Smallwood, KUJH.